Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. In the last episode, we took off, uh, faced off against the boss of the Skyview Temple, the Demon Lord Girahim. And after a little bit of a struggle, he gives up and leaves and says that he's going to go find Princess Zelda somewhere else. And uh, we get a heart container and get another piece of the ancient tablet. And now we can head back to Skyloft to put the next piece of the ancient tablet in, which will give us to our next location. But we got a bunch of side quest stuff, a bunch of stuff that we're going to pick up first before heading off to the neck of putting the tablet in and going to the next area. Anyway, here we got a cut scene right off the bat, so. It's one of the Geekwees. Hey, it's Geekwee. Did you find the girl? Not yet. Oh, that's too bad, but it sounds like you at least know what you need to search tonight to find her. That's something, right? Yeah. It's something about Elden. I'm so glad I finally ran out of all my kiwi friends. It's all thanks to you, Kui. With any luck, hopefully you'll find that girl you've been searching for real soon. Kui. Take care, okay? Alright. So now with this, we now have... Uh-oh. Wait to see the integrity of your shield as we can be wary of the remaining durability of this item. You know, we can go to Skyloft to take care of that. Alright, so now, remember those three goddess cubes that we got? We can now go get the treasures from them, and then we'll go head back to Skyloft to pick, pick up a few. But we can go to the statue right here and go right to the sky. But we're going to go uh, take care of the three go goddess cubes and get the treasures from them. And uh, then we'll go to Skyloft and do some stocking up and do some stuff taken care of before heading off to the next area. So. So, Master Link. When you hit that goddess cube with the Skyward Strike early, I was able to detect the resulting energy reaction above the clouds. The location I have marked on your map indicates the spot where I sense an energy reaction. So we're going to put Beacon there. I advise you to investigate the area around this location. What you going to do? Now we've got to look around for Beacon. Right over here. Got two of the got two of the treasure chest the treasure chest and the goddess cubes right on this island. So we're, we're going to head to this island first and grab those. Every goddess cube that you strike, you get a treasure chest from it. That this area right here is where I'm going to need to go here eventually anyway because a couple of side quests we can take care of here. So. Here's one of the three goddess cubes treasures we can get right now. What is we get? An extra additional edition count shot. Nice. So now we got a fifth edition, a, a, a additional. If I remember correctly, though, it's up here at the top. So we need to fall down. We're gonna fly back up and try to hit that. Yeah, see right there on top of the uh, awning. There we go. Here's the other one. And what do we get out of this? What do we get? Nobody knows. And we get a gold rupee. 300 rupees. And it says, Master, your wallet is full. You'll not be able to collect any more rupees. So you can only carry 300 at a time right now. But we're going to rectify that in a minute. Go ahead and get rid of the beacon.
And let's put it right here on this one, because this is where the other goddess statue is. Maybe the goddess of uh, treasure is. You can notice it's over there. Let's get there a little bit faster. See these little rocks are just flying around? Kind of chilling. Go through the middle of them. Come on. Go in the middle of them. There you go. Yeah. The other treasure chest is right. Yeah. Well, I kind of missed the island. Right here on this island. Yeah. Right here in the middle. <laughs> Alright. And then this goddess cube treasure chest is here. A piece of art. There you go. Yeah. Oh, there you go. So now we can start heading back towards the spot. Skyloft is really easy to see because it's the biggest island in the area, so. The right way out there. Tornadoes flying in random locations and kept a little bit. The same tornadoes that kind of carry Princess Zelda off, so just be careful with those. They really don't do too much, so they just kind of disorient you until you. You're eventually going to start cutting out, like, return trips and stuff like that. But Right now, it's not nothing to worry about right now. So, it's just landing Skyloft somewhere. Right here. We're back to land right in front of the bazaar. All right, so let's look around a little bit. I heard you won the ring ceremony. Congratulations, that's incredible. Hey, you don't seem all that happy about winning. What's the matter? Uh, if only you knew. But anyway, now that we got the slingshot, you notice there's a ship right here. That kind of floating around up there at the top. Ring that bell. Ring the bell. And you'll notice that that's way over there on the other side. Ain't nothing we can do about that, right? Alright, try this again. Ring the bell. Notice the rope coming. Grab on the rope. Takes you up here to this flying ship of shippiness. What's up in here? This, this is kind of cool. Hey, who are you? Oh, you come all this way? It's so rare to have a customer here. Beetle's airship has everything you could ever want. Please take a look around. Yeah, but it's Beetle. Remember Beetle was like in the ships and Scott, uh, Wind Waker and stuff like that? Yep, he was at the airship this time. And if you actually buy stuff, that would be even better. I might actually buy some stuff, though. First things first, let's get the, the, the net. Whoa! Then we got some. And 50 rupees, yeah, we'll buy it. We'll buy it. We'll buy it. So now we got a bug net. Which will come from? Oh, it really spooks you. What about this? Oh. Extra wallet carries to uh, lets you carry 200, uh, 300 extra rupees. 
we'll buy that too. So now we can carry up to 600 rupees. Yay! That's gonna be that definitely comes. Thank oh, you! Oh, so much for giving me the stupid keep pedaling. And then this thing right here, if you want it. Oh. That's a life medal. It's so a bunch of mysterious and mystical effects and whoever carries it. What kind of effects? Don't ask me. I don't actually know. You should find out for yourself. I'm pretty sure it's a real bargain. In. No, we don't have it. Oh. oh, please take a look at the other things I have for sale. And there's an extra adventure pouch if you want it. Which I think I'll buy that too. Oh. I don't have the money for it, so. Oh. But I'm going to show you a little Easter egg. I'm pretty sure some of y'all probably already know about it. But it's funny. But it's not. It's funny. <laughs> Basically, jump back down. Really hard. One shot. Ring the bell again. So we're going to come back down. I'm gonna go back into the beetle shop. Alright. Let's take a look around again. Maybe he's got something new. Well, actually, he does, but. You know what? We don't have the money. Let's go. Maybe I actually gotta buy a look at something to buy. Oh. That's a bug metal, you able to see what bugs are down. Thousand rupees. Oh. Alright, oh. there you go. Oh, please wait a moment. Hi. Do you know how heavy you are? I had to pedal extra hard with you up here. Did you have the gall to leave without buying anything? Off with you! And he goes. And he just kind of throws you out of the ship. <laughs> Ow. Alright, so now let's head to Uh, we already talked to you. Let's head to the bar. See what we got up in here. I do. I need a. Uh, I need you to set the ship on my shield, please. Oh yeah. Fix my shield. <laughs> For now. I might be getting a new shield anyway, so. Okay. So I'm about to be probably getting a new shield anyway, so I don't even know why I'm patching this up, but hey, eh, it is. All done, here you go. <laughs> Looks like you got the shields that need repairing. See you later. Let's go over here to the uh Where is he at? Let's talk to you first. Hello, welcome to the item check. So is there anything in the account that you want to move? Sure. Alright, let's see it. Okay, thank you for coming in. I'll come back to that in just a second. Ah, see, there is a new shield. Ah, that's a new iron stock to show you, friend. Okay, well, now you can purchase an iron shield and small seed satchel. I hope they meet your approval. Ah, uh, that's a fair story. The iron shield is much more durable than a wooden shield, and I'm happy to report that it won't burst into flames. Rosa, she wanted to touch you from electricity, but she could come as an nasty shock. If yours for just 100 rupees. Yes. Now we're going to a new iron shield. <laughs> Thanks for being loyal and continue patronage, friend. If you have any doubts about the durability of your shield, it's a chance you have I'm at the scrap shop. Yep. If I need to take good, good gondo there, the necessary treasures and the like, you'll be happily upgrade your items. Seed satchel here is you can carry ten more seeds for your build for your and it's a hundred rupees. You don't have the money, so. <laughs> that's really all I'm gonna do right now. But 
bring Zara. Hi. Let's put our, our wooden shield up in there. Hi. So now let's uh now we have a, a nice handy dandy iron shield which doesn't burst into flames but we have to worry about electricity. Yeah, yeah let's see, do we have a Yeah, yes please. Go ahead and just use the rest of my money. Use the rest of my money and use the rest of my There we go. There we got two full bars and a heart and a heart. And I'm out of money. <laughs> Alright. So there's a couple more things we can just take a look at. And then we'll go put the ancient tablet in to get ready for the next area. So if I remember correctly, she's up here? I could be wrong. It may not be time, time for that yet, but it doesn't hurt the chat. Let's look up here. Actually, this is where we need to go next to put the ancient tablet in. I know for sure she ain't up there. How goes your social Zelda? Remember to find a bed and sleep if you're getting tired. A quick nap can restore your heart and refresh your mind to explore after dark. Yeah, dark. There's a couple things you can do after after dark. That would definitely uh, help you out. So. I don't see her yet, so I guess we're not quite ready for that yet. We'll look around a little bit more. Yeah, she's not showing up yet, so I guess we're not quite ready for that yet. So what we can go ahead and do is go ahead and go put the next piece of the uh, ancient tablet in. So, alright. So, all you have to do here, instead of having to take that long way around, all you have to do is just stand right here now. This is a lot easier now. Inside the statue of the goddess, all you have to do is just go. Oh yeah, you want, all you do is just put it in. <laughs> you don't have to worry about the scabbers and stuff, but there's that piece of tablet. You know, there's now a red crystal on there. There's this red crystal. Shoots out the beam of light from the statue, and it opens up our next location. Master, I have confirmed the location of a second opening of Cloud Barrier. It's located in the sky to the northeast. The opening will allow you to access a new area in the surface. I suggest you fly there as soon as you complete the necessary preparations. I'm going to look at one more thing to see if she shows up this time. If not, we're going to end the video and then we can come back. I'll, uh, I'm going to go take care of one more little side quest that we can get started with and then we'll head off to the next area. Let's see if she shows up. Come on. Oh, see, now, now hey. she shows up. Cookie, cookie, where did that child have gone? So she, so she don't show up until after you put the tablet in. There. Oh, cookie, where did you go? Well, I do. She's been kidnapped. Oh, Link. Uh, who's cookie? What perfect timing? You haven't seen my cookie, have you? Nope. I, I see. Please, Link, won't you help me look for her? I've been looking everywhere, but I can't find her. I asked everyone I could find for help, and then a few people should have said she's fine with some unknown person with a scary face. Someone who even said that they've been carried off by a monster. A monster! She 
must have been kidnapped. She's so cute and friendly. Some of us have walked, just walked off with her. Thank you, Kyo. Please, please, it breaks my heart to think that she's out there somewhere crying. Please, Link. You got it. Thank you. The Night Academy should be proud of a student like you. Please, find my daughter quickly. Looks like her daughter. So, there's a lot of... Oh, uh, yeah, this is what happens if you fall off the uh, sky loft. <laughs> Somebody comes rescue me, son. Watch your step there. Haven't they talked to the camera that I must always be vigilant, sharp enough, and it'll never make it to knighthood. Oh, I'm already made it to knighthood. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, there, somebody comes and picks you up. Hey. But, uh, that starts off with one of the biggest side quests in the game. Uh, with that, with her talking to her. There ain't too much we can do about some of it right now, but we can get started on a couple of them. But, uh, well, yeah. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at, Shade Point? There's a safe point around here somewhere. Here we are. Sorry about that. We're going into here, guys. We'll come back. We can start a little bit on the Kukio quest. We're going to see if I can see if I can take care of that. I think. Then we got one more location we can go to. Then we're off to the next uh, area that we just opened up in the sky. The Red Barrier to Elden Volcano. So you have a good day. We'll see y'all next time. On Let's play The Legend of Zelda: Skyward Sword. This is DKS3, the Crazy Gamer, signing out.